So what do you want to do? Do whatever you want. Why don't we go see the band at the garage? I heard they were good. Or what about that new indie film where the couple has to learn sign language because the guy contracts some sort of rare disease and slowly going deaf? You know I'll do whatever you want. Um, should we go to the cove? I don't really like that place. Tell me what you want. You always like the cove. You want to sit at a table or the bar? You know I prefer a table. Well, should we sit at the bar? Sure. Hey, what can I get for you? We're gonna, We're gonna have, have dinner. Appetizers. What do you want? You choose. No, you decide. Why don't we get the Mediterranean salad with the side of broccoli rabe? It's an awful lot of greens. I know, it's healthy, right? Do you want to get the crab? No, not really. Well, why don't we get the crab and the salad? I don't really want crab. Sure, whatever. A uh, dirty martini for me, a pinot. A margarita. And we'll have the crab with a Mediterranean salad. Great, get it right in. Have some crab. No thanks. Why not? I don't really want it. Because it's a bottom feeder and you don't think it's healthy? You make it sound like an ambulance chasing lawyer. And yes. That's ridiculous. Everybody eats crab. And clams and catfish and- Shark. Bottom feeders one and all. Why do we even order it then? We didn't. You did. Why didn't you tell me you thought the crab wasn't a healthy choice? Well, you just told me, so obviously you knew. Well, if you told me, I wouldn't have ordered it. Well, if you knew, why would I have to tell you? You should have told me. Okay, Harry. It was expensive. Have some. Still don't want any. Dude. You're killing me, and I'm already dead. Where'd you learn to listen? Underwater? Look, next thing that happens is, she is gone, and you're gonna find your shell collection strewn haphazardly along the beach. Believe me, I've been there. Hey, maybe that's what you want with this passive aggressive act. Maybe you're driving her away because you don't have the claws to dig in directly, you know what I mean? Hey. Hey, no, that's not it at all. I just, I think I should give her what she wants. So I try, uh, I don't know. Jesus, why are you looking at me like that? Harry, Harry, relax. I'm here to help. Look, let me tell you a story. A long time ago, when I was born, and we're going back quite a few months now, I had a seriously overprotective mother. She was always saying things like, Junior, watch out for the crab pot. Or Junior, don't eat the dead fish head. It's a trap. Or Junior, stay off the beach. Those seagulls will swallow you whole. The point I'm making is, she was relentless. It made me nervous. I was a wreck. I'd go to grab a minnow for lunch. It looked like a barracuda. You know what I'm saying? Thing is, I was afraid of everything, but I came to discover that behind the fear, I was also harboring unexpressed resentment. Who did you resent? Who, Einstein? My mother, of course. Are you paying attention? Yeah, I, I guess, sure. Jeez, sorry. Anyway, I hit maiden age, procreation all the fun of life, and I start taking out my resentment on other females in a passive-aggressive way. See, the real target is either forbidden or unavailable, so we find a suitable substitute, sweet soft-shell crabs who, by nature, 
I'm literally supposed to be on their backs to propagate. Now, I'm treating it like a control thing. Like God forbid I should engage in actual courtship. A little romance. I'm telling you, I was really out of touch. Are you following me? Yes. Yes, I think so. Good. Have another sip, Harry. This is tough stuff. Look, I don't know your damage, but somewhere along the line, your relationship skills have become tainted. To her, it just seems like you're not listening. But it's a lot worse. You hear what she's saying, but with the information, you're secretly setting a trap so you can A, control things, and B, dish out a little punishment. Again, classic passive aggressive behavior, which, as I said before, is based on all resentments. It's a game, and you don't even know you're playing it. Am I going too fast for you? No, I mean, yes, I mean, I hear you. Don't just say that, Harry. You're gonna have to do some serious excavating, if you know what I mean. Some self-examination. And don't look now, but she's checking out the guy at the end of the bar. Another margarita? Actually, let's keep it simple. Make it a shot of tequila. Don't worry. Has nothing to do with him. She just feels trapped and needs to escape. Believe me, I know trapped. And I'll tell you, just between you and me, sometimes I feel that life itself is a navigation through an ocean of ostensible behavior. It's an existential burden, Harry. Hey, send some of that this way, will you? Wait a minute. How do you know all these things? Fish have schools, Harry. Just because you're a crustacean doesn't mean you have to stay primitive your whole life. You know what I mean? Look, all I'm telling you is, you gotta start noticing your motivations. Or at least admit that you're unhappy with the way things are. Wow, you've put a lot on my plate. I'll do the jokes, Harry. No, no, I'm, I mean, you're right. This has all been about me. Always end up doing what I want to do, and I'm always trying to be in control. And I'll tell you something, it's a little boring. It's predictable. It's almost like I'm protecting myself from relationship. It's like I have a shell. Careful, Harry. Wow. What can I do to change? Dude, for starters, get some therapy. You're like hallucinating on one martini. So why aren't you eating the crab? I'm not sure. Excuse me. Would you mind if we move to a table? Sure. We'll, we'll have, have the eggplant. eggplant. 